smell. They don't smell. Tell the truth. You don't think those dogs smell? You know, some people happen to enjoy the smell of dogs. They stink. Russ, Jerry, and Sid were three ordinary guys. To what do we owe this honor? I was in the neighborhood. I didn't hear any alarms going off. He's always welcome. He's always here. Desperate for their big break. You know all those old people who wait in front of the supermarkets? We start our own car service. This is a niche. And yeah, we found the niche. Are we lost? What's the problem here? There's no problem. You take me home. Why don't you just shut your mouth? I'm, I'm Mr. News. Just... I think the whole thing's a little too servile. What? I understand? Too servile. Servile. Yeah, it's servile. It sucks. You got a better idea? But when they took on a life of crime, I'm talking about a momentary shift in lifestyle. They never realized it would be so much work. Hey, this is next door. You know what next door? Hurry up! You set up a jewelry store, then you rob a jewelry store. You don't rob a bakery. Hi. Hi. Can I come in? Who is that? A friend of the dogs? The Samuel Goldwyn Company presents a comedy. Are you a thief? Why do I look like one? About the thrill of it. We cannot rob an armored truck. Give us only armed robbery if we carry guns. So what are we gonna do with mirrors? Toys. The lure of it. Maybe if he found himself a girl this time, instead of a fuzzy dog. Why not? I'm gonna start whining. I'm gonna start whining. And the art of getting it. Pass him. <laughs> Any way you can. Oh, look at this. What's he wearing masks for? I'm gonna rob you. Oh, We're not cut out for this. Some people are, for instance, criminals. The Lukaville, life in the fast lane, never took so long.